Hey everybody, welcome to Rem TV and welcome back to my LB The Show 20 New York Mets franchise with the New York Mets. This is episode 6 and here we are for this uh, April 29th game against the NL East leading Miami Marlins. We are one game back, so if you win this, we can tie them up. So we get Jacob DeGraub on the mound against, uh, who's, this is uh, Jordan Yamamoto. We're going to be playing Miami. Uh, so let's get it and let's keep Jake the Grom undefeated at 6 and 0. Oh. School, I think I kind of stand right along that bench, but one thing that gets me up is watching guys cry. Wait, quick. He says that stolen base for Jonathan VR. Hey, thanks, Matty. Hey, you know what, Dero? Try to get on kind of a little minute. High and deep to center field. Ranging back is Nimmo. It's going to be a sacrifice. VR is going to score, so it's going to be 1 0 here in the first inning. For the Marlins. That's a fastball. Too bad Joyce to strike him out to end the inning. But that is the Marlins with a 1 0 lead after that sacrifice. Play the plate. And he's going to be gunned down. That is Dominic Smith with a great throw. Trying to just sacrifice, but that was just way too easy for Dominic Smith. Ahmed Rosario, he'll get to take his first cuts here. That is Rosario driving to deep left center field, and it's out of here. That is a solo shot by Ahmed Rosario going 408 feet. That is number two in the year, and things are tied up at one here in the third. He got a hold of that one. He went into the stands. Hey, listen, there's an old adage in baseball that solo home runs won't Great contact. That is Ario. A solo home run right here is not the end of the world. That's a base hit by McNeil. So that's the second base hit of the game. Now this one is a first and second with one out here in the third inning. Good piece of hitting, pulling it just slightly. Okay, Pete Alonso with a base hit. The ground's rounding and he's going to be safe at home. It's an RBI single for Pete Alonso. That is a shot by Conforto, and it's a grand slam, a grand slam by Michael Conforto. That is home run number six, and the Mets are up six to one. The Mets unloading on Yamamoto here in the third inning. Wow, Conforto just sends a liner out there. That is a rope. Jake DeGrom going to get on the action with a sacrifice. It's going to be 7-1. The the That's another base hit. It's going to be 8-1. That's dropping an 8-piece here in the third inning. An RBI single for Jeff Mc... Oh, I'm sorry, that's Brandon Nimmo. Hit and run. Oh, this is going to score two more. It's going to be... He's going to try to push for a triple, but he's going to be safe, but... He's going to be caught at third. But that is ten runs delivered in the third inning. That is a shot by Cano. This is a home run. I dug that out of there as a solo shot. Number two for Cano. Going 408 feet. One run on three hits and one error so far. One two to Jorge Alfaro. Yeah, I'm swinging through a fastball. Back to back strikeouts for the Grom. Almost, Matty. Almost went deep his last AB. Certainly just missed it. With this guy's. Conforto again driving into the ball. This is an upper deck shot. Michael Conforto with a solo shot, his second of the game. 
going 415 feet right off Conley. That's number seven. I got out of here in a hurry. As they just continue to pour it on here. Let's take a look at a replay here. Well, as a team, they've gone yard four times. Boom. And this guy's accounted for that was just so fast out of here into the upper deck. There you go. Are you kidding me? Familia, that's the first thing you do coming into the game? Give him a solo shot? Oh my god, man. Unbelievable. Brian is in the game, making him two for four. This guy's having a pretty good week so far in one game. Conforto! With a hat trick! Michael Conforto hitting his third home run in the game. That's right. Third home run in the game. Launches it to left field. Going 420 feet. Showing his power going the opposite direction. That's number eight. Boom. As soon as he hit it, he knew it was gone. That is also Ramos with a bomb. Wow. Wilson Ramos dug that out of here. 389 feet. Number three of the year, making things 14 to 6. As we near the end of this one, I think it's safe to say that the story of the game has undoubtedly been the long ball. Oh my gosh, back to back. Rosario with his second home of the game. Back to back jacks. Wow, and they just continue to tee off. In Miami. This is home run derby in Miami right now. A solo shot Miami's had three home runs. The Mets have hit the game maybe five or six already. Nine now. Two by Rosario. Two by, three by Conforto. One by... Um, yeah, it's just... <laughs> i trying to remember who hit all the home runs. One by Ramos. Jeez. Three into the VR. Justin Wilson coming from the bullpen. This is going to be a pop up to Rosario. Should wrap things up. And it's ball game over. The Mets win 15 to 6. Behind the bats of Michael Conforto and the okay pitching of Jacob DeGrom. But that keeps him at a 6 0, tying him for the most wins in the NL East, or the NL rather. Rosario with two home runs. That's heck of a, a heck of game for him. The player of the game, Michael Gordon, four or three home runs, six RBI, three for five game. Wow. Offensive onslaught here in Miami. I, wow, I did not expect that because, you know, last episodes I've had a little trouble scoring, but, you know, we were able to knock this out and just destroy Miami, winning the series. All right. So then we're going to have uh, Syndergaard up next. So we're going to be sending all the way up to right here. Same through date. Auto utilize. Oh, wait. Oh, damn it. No. We lost. Lost. Damn it. Uh, end. That's one. Nope. Okay. We're down though. Come on. All right, so we're down six to five against Cincinnati. Uh, Rosario it just needs a triple for a cycle, but that's not what we need right now. We need this win. There's no outs, so I'm gonna try to jump in here and get W. Okay, so we ended up, we ended up losing uh, six to five, kind of close, but the Grongas is first loss of the game. Match on 19 and 17, and we're gonna be facing off this. We're gonna do the uh, the rubber match. With no Senegal, who's 1-3 right now, with a 4.5 ERA against Trevor Bauer, who's 1-5. Um, so, neither pitcher is doing that well right now, but we're going to try to get this W and win this rubber match. And, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of my MLB, the show 20 New York Mets franchise. Don't forget, don't forget to click the like button, leave any comments below, and if you did, uh, click the thumbs up. I think I said that already. And subscribe. Uh, hope you guys have a great day. Take it easy, and peace.